Hello everybody, my name is Patrick McGriff and I welcome you back for another episode of The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. So in the last episode we ended off somewhere over here on the mountain where I said I would climb on top of the mountain and uh, basically just you know, keep looking for... Oops. Oops, keep looking for oops. Uh, I said I would keep looking for the Gerudo, but I climbed up the mountain and it did not look like a place where uh, there would be any Gerudo tribes, um, like a uh, place of something, where they would reside basically. Uh, but and it was really cold up there, and I did not have any any like cold resistance food, so I couldn't really stay up there. Uh, I'm not saying there wasn't anything interesting up there because there definitely was like some really intriguing stuff there, but um, well, I couldn't stay there because I you know couldn't. I actually did waste one of my uh, flint things. Yeah, this to create like a fire so I could light my torch. But um, yeah, there wasn't anything I could do up there. And the torch has now gone out as well. So uh, basically a waste of time and a waste of resources going up there. But uh, I did set a waypoint, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, I did set like a star up there. So I know there's at least something going on over there. But in the last episode, we also noticed some awesome stuff in the background. One of which was this maze. So <laughs> I do not know what to expect from this. But I guess we'll see. We're about to see right away. Uh, and I, I, I really can't wait to find, like, the Gerudo place, because, like, I am looking for the town, and I can't find it, but I'm guessing it's somewhere nearby, because, you know, we're at the Gerudo Highlands. Make, what, make, what kind of makes sense, you know? Gerudo Highlands, the South Lomayer Labyrinth. Hello. <laughs> oh my god, guys, that was awesome. Like, this is just the way we dropped out of the sky here. I was afraid I was gonna die there. But this awesome factor just completely made it work. Wait, wait, wait! I would like to get that guy's stuff, but okay, I guess that's not gonna happen. So is there any, like, point in running on here? Like, do we actually have to jump in there? Because, like, with the mazes, my attitude is usually that, uh, like, don't go in the maze, go around the walls, right? Okay, well, that dude landed down there, and he def- Ah! Ah, okay, okay, good, 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 just, uh, wow. This is, these walls are really high, like, guys, look, to you who sets foot here, my blessing awaits you at the labyrinth's end. Okay, we don't have a map of this area, do we? Ah, oh, shrine quests, the desert labyrinth, is this a shrine? I guess that's interesting, okay, now I wish I had, like, a way of running faster, like, I mean, of course, we can sprint like that, but that doesn't allow us to sprint for, uh, forever, yeah, I ran out of stamina, which is just great. Alright, I hope this doesn't take too long. Are there traps? What is that? Oh, it's that. Oh, that's a shrine. Uh, yeah. That's what our notification thing is going crazy for. Okay, so shrine something. Maybe that's what they mean. Like, we have to reach that shrine. Is this not... This is not a direction we want to take. This map is huge. Okay, now I, like, really wish I could have a horse or something here. But no, sadly, both of my horses are safe at the stables. Which right now is an inconvenience for us. I should have maybe stayed up there. I could still go up there, maybe from the outside. Can I do that? I don't know. Wait, was this the entrance? Is this where we entered? What's gonna... Okay, yes, this is where we entered from. Uh, okay, I guess I'll try... Like, it didn't seem like it was too complex of a structure here. I don't know. So, here's the dude we knocked off earlier. Ha! <laughs> you thought you were all alone here now, huh? Well, I came back for you. And, um, you might not be happy about that. Oh, I want... Actually, hold on, guys. I do want that club. That looks like an interesting thing. Uh, so what can we throw away? I think this one kind of sucks. This thing sucks. Um, the club might suck even more, but who really knows? Oh, that looks like a really good... Like, I do not know what, uh, what these numbers mean, but I'm guessing the bigger the better. Like, I, I don't know. Maybe these indicate, uh... Durability or attack damage or something like that, but like I'm definitely guessing the bigger the numbers are the better And this one was 45 which hold on. I think that might actually be the biggest uh, Yes, yes, that is the biggest uh, weapon number I we have whatever the numbers mean Where is this this what's going on? <laughs> Guys Whoa, wait, is this the wait? I remember reading from the hint screens that there's something like a really dangerous goo, a calamity goo or whatever, and I think this is it. We do not want to step in that, probably. Oh, wait, do not climb the wall. There's absolutely no point in doing that. Okay, oh my god, this maze! Guys, I am not liking this already. What, what? What, what, what? Where, where are, guys, I'm completely lost. 
like not not like super super duper lost, but like I am quite lost already. Where are we going? <laughs> okay, the, well this was a circle, but a small circle. Okay, uh, I think there's what what am I doing, guys? Where am I going? Yeah, okay, do we want to go this way? Let's just see. I think I know fairly certainly where the shrine is that we saw. Okay, where is this taking us? Seriously. I think the shrine is like right over there in this direction uh, towards like the red thing or it might be the blue thing I think it's towards the red thing on the map I think I, like I wasn't really paying attention but I think that's the direction the shrine is supposed to be in I am not really certain where we went because I am not 100% certain on the sizes of this okay wait this is where we came from right yes okay good 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 we made it back here so, my uh, sense of direction was actually not completely up. What did we just make it out of here? Is this the outside of the... Well, no, it's not. Where are we doing? I really want a horse or something that would let me move faster. Okay, do we want to go this way? I don't know. This looks like it's outside the maze. Oh, these huge walls feel so scary. I feel like... Uh, it would be so easy to like just knock something onto me or these things could collapse. That would just be so easy. Like it just seems so dangerous down here. Like honestly imagine tons of moblins up there shooting their bows at me or just something bad like that. Like that's that could be so easily arranged and stuff. Okay, I really want to get back on top there. Jumping down was an incredibly foolish idea. Like we would probably not have gotten the dialogue. We got there at the beginning, but like how important was that really? Maybe they do expect you to actually like uh, enter from there and they won't let you get the prize otherwise, but who knows. Okay, let's actually just use our uh, stamina as much as we can. Just don't waste it like I just did, <laughs> because that's not a good idea. Come on, run, 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 and don't let it run out completely. So what's this place then? Hello? Uh, so now we're on the other side, if I'm not mis- Okay, that's some goo, we do not want to get involved with that. So now we're on the other side of the maze, right? Like, uh, everything goes in 90 degree turns, we should be on the other side of the maze. Uh, that should leave the shrine somewhere in this direction. You know, if we could actually figure out... Uh, hello? Whoa! Wait, is this the... Oh, well, we can't climb this- uh, not too far, though. We can't climb this too far. Okay, but this is like a place near where we're going, isn't it? Oh, well, this is just a circle. But this thing, like these, whatever those are, they look interesting. So, we get another look at those from here. Oh. Oh, well, would you look at... What is this? This is a chest. Don't tell me it's a trap. Like, I feel like when, when, I, when I see or hear maze... Oh, my God! 300 rupees? Wow! Okay, I would actually really like to know, like, what's the wallet limit for this game? We can't go that way. I wonder if there's anything we can do with the goo to get, like, uh, rid of it. To, like, uh, make it not affect us too much. Uh, there's goo that way as well. I'm guessing this goo stuff is blocking you. But what I was saying earlier... Wait, this drop was kind of scary. So, guys, what I was saying earlier is that, like, when I hear... Like, uh, something I associate with, uh, with, the, with the word maze and with, like, the concept concept of a maze. I always associate like uh, traps and stuff like that with uh, with mazes and that's why I'm kind of scared here. Like of course this goo is already pretty freaky but uh, just like imagine like some kind of creepy traps. Okay, ah that goo is so scary. Like I don't want, I don't want to go near it. I'm so scared of it. Like I know it's bad. It looks bad but what it does exactly? They didn't explain that. And that's, that, that does not make me happy. Where are we? Oops, don't throw that away. Wait. Wait, some torches. I'm assuming that's not a bad thing. Is, is it a bad thing, guys? Tell me, is this a bad thing? Is it bad when you find the torches? I don't know. We found a something. There's tor- Ah, we don't go that way. Well, or maybe there's like a turn left here. Ah, oh, I hate mazes. I hate this one a lot because it's where are we going like I'm guessing we want to see that shrine right don't we don't we want to see that shrine where are we going guys what is this place <laughs> I want to get out guys let me out let me out of this maze oh my god 
Guys, one thing I should point out, oh my god, I completely forgot, um, uh, my, I fixed the audio quality issues, as far as I can tell, like, I think I fixed the, oh, and there's a shrine, nice, uh, I, I think I fixed the audio quality issues, I changed some settings, and, um, yeah, I was basically getting ready to record the Splatoon 2 global test for air stuff, and then I, I, I just, um, messed with the settings, because, like, the audio quality was really disturbing me, and I just did something in my, um, recording software settings, and then suddenly, oops, I fixed it. So, we actually completed the Desert Labyrinth Shrine quest, which was crazy. I, I was really getting lost there. We made it, guys. It's awesome. So, yeah, guys, just, um, I want to congratulate you and me and everybody on, uh, on the fact that I, I figured out it. I figured it out. <laughs> what did I just say? I figured out it. I figured out it. That's it. So we just legit come over here, we can see the monk. Dila Mog, by entering this place you've already proven your worth. I love this. This is inter- I didn't mean to skip this. Well, whatever. Dila Mog Shrine, hello. I don't actually want to talk to that monk yet, because, um, like, they say- Oh! Whoa! Armor once favored by an ancient warlike tribe from the Pharaon region. The war paint bolsters your fighting spirit and raises your attack power. The barbarian armor. Our first actual bit of armor as far as I can tell, like everything we have this far is just clothes basically. Uh, get out the water please. Okay, but I'm actually really suspicious of this because they say by entering this place you've already proven your worth, which I do not want to disagree with, like jeez, that maze was, was completely worthy of a shrine, but... Okay guys, sorry I had to burp there, but um, basically, like when they tell you that, that instantly makes me suspicious, like ah, there has to be some sort of a secret here. And they're trying to trick me, right? Like, there's this one chest, but like, isn't there another one? Maybe the other one is actually in the hidden in the maze. Oh, no, but I now... I hate it! Guys, why do I have to be a person who wants to complete everything? Now I want to... Like, I don't want... You have done well to arrive at this shrine. A hero rises to right the wrongs of Hyrule. Good. But now I want to explore the whole maze, like, th thoroughly to figure out if there's another chest in there or not. I am not, <laughs> I'm not happy, guys, I, 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 I think I might have to do that. I'm definitely gonna, like, set a waypoint here at this, uh, at this place, <laughs> but, uh, like, I, I don't know, I guess I'll see what I'll do, skip this cutscene, and exit the shrine, but, ah, I, I, I don't know what I'll do, because, like, I want to get everything, I just don't know if that's gonna happen right now. Or if there is, like, that's the worst part. If I knew for sure there is a chest in here, I would go ahead and explore the whole maze. There would not, not even be a question. But now that I don't even know if there is a thing like that, how on earth am I supposed to know if I'm supposed to explore this or not? Like, what? Is anyone gonna tell me? Oh, by the way, guys, another question I have here. How are we gonna get to exit the shrine? Oh, I think that question is answered pretty easy. Ah! Pretty easily. Yep, you can just come in here. Wait, is this... Where was the thing? Oh, oh, uh, I think... Like, is this where they blocked it off? Oh yeah, they just removed that blocking thing. Okay, good, good, good. <laughs> I was starting to understand where I was. Because I was getting confused. So, what's the recording time at? I could check that, but I'm not gonna... I'm just gonna assume that it's less than I think what it... Less than I think it is, because that's the usually the case. So, we have a waypoint here now. Uh, guys, actually, hold on. What I want to do is I want to remove... Oh, uh, wait, no, 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 cancel, cancel, cancel. Um, I set a waypoint here, like, um, this thing, the pin. Um, I want to delete this pin now I now, now that we have this star waypoint thing here. So, how do we get up this mountain? Uh, actually, let's head over here. This road looks like it, it leads up the mountain. So now our destination is that red waypoint we set over there. Come on, guys, I... Like, I'm feeling it. We have to be close to the Gerudo tribe's hideout. The only problem is that this map is so freaking huge, I can't find anything. Well, I can find stuff. I can find a lot of stuff. But I can't. I just can't find the stuff that I really need. Or want to find. Like, of course, it's great. We found a huge maze. We got a... Like, don't get me wrong. We found a huge maze. We got armor from it. <laughs> that's... Like, that's amazing by any means. But just, uh... I want to find something else right now. Like, if you, you look for something and you never find what you're looking for, you just find the stuff. Like, you had no idea it even existed. You find a lot of stuff. You don't find what you were looking for. So that thing over there. Ah! Like, that, that huge thing moving over there. I can't wait to check that out. 
Is there anything up there? Like, what are these rock pillars? Uh, they, like, from far away, they look like they could be some sort of an establishment. What is that? What are those things? Guys, are these bones? Bones of what? I don't know. Let's just steer clear from those for now. At least, what is that? Wait, guys! Does that place not remind you of, like, the haunted wasteland from Ocarina of Time? Like, the place where there's, like, stormy and you can't see where you're going and, like, that place, doesn't it? Oh, wait, but guys, this thing looks like a Korok might be hiding here. Hello? Okay, we probably have to place it... Uh, yeah, not, not using bombs. Oh, well, great, now we have our... Okay, go, go, pick it up. Can we place it in, like, uh... Okay, what could be missing here? Uh, let's just see. Do we have to make these, like, equally looking... Place it there? Like that? Nice, there we go. So they're like reflections-ish of each other. Hello, Korok. I found you. Nice. Nice. And I say, I love finding Koroks. Thank you. Bye-bye. So I guess our bomb is just gonna hang out over there. So what is up with this place? Like, the huge dude is over there. Okay, guys, come on. This has to be, like, really close to a Gerudo place. Uh, let's just glide down from here, I guess. Wait, is this... Oh, it's cold here! You gotta warn me before I leap leapt into this! I guess I could be careful myself. Oh, jeez. Guys, this is bad. This is bad. Make it day. Someone, please. Oh, uh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Well, I'm, I'm fairly certain it, uh, the game auto-saved uh, after we got the Korok. So, uh, at least that's some sort of like thing. Like, oh, I wanted to go over there and do stuff, but uh, that's not gonna happen. Because now, my goal is to survive here in the cold. Like, I, I know that's how it works in real life as well, but it's just still so funny, like, being in a desert and freezing to death. I don't know, that concept it just is funny. Uh, what are these things? Let's see. Plant! I know you're evil! Ah, show yourself! Okay, nothing happened. Nothing happened, that's just a normal plant. What is going on over here? Come on, it doesn't look really cold right now. Like, it, it feels like it should be warmer already. Like, in that other place, it certainly felt cold, but now it looks warm. But I guess it's not. So what's up with this rock? It, it, these things instantly bring to mind the huge stone Talus, the huge stone monster we fought. But, uh, like, I cannot imagine if this thing were actually a rock monster. If that were to, like, just suddenly, like, be alive, that would be really freaky. Lock this, knock this dude off here. I think that's a Lysol foe. Well, now it's, oh, we're still freezing to death. I was about to say, like, now it's bound to be warmer, but apparently not. Uh, well, that's, ooh. Uh, these are huge skulls. Whoa. Okay, guys, just rush in there. I'm gonna run out of food like this. Oh my god, stop that. Is this a Korok place? Oh, this is a Korok puzzle, isn't it? But I can't do it. Because there's, it's so cold. Wait, no it isn't. In here it's actually warm. Ah, but that's nice. Whoa, what? What are you doing? You're using your tongue for sick... Ouch. Ouch. Oh, whoa. Rolling off the stone. Wait, stop it. Stop it. Let's gain some advantage by height, which wasn't really an advantage last time. Are they shooting us with arrows? Go, 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 go. Get out of here. What are these things? Like, they... Like, I, I would... I want to call them Lysolfo, but they are not... That much like Lysol foe. Oh, uh, what do we want to use here? Let's uh, let's use the eightfold long blade. The weapons in this game are so cool. I swear. Ah! Don't kill me. Okay, what is this step? A Lysol foe. Oh, yes, these are Lysol foe. Ah! What? Pro tip, guys. Don't go near those guys. And I need to co uh, cook some uh, heat resist. I mean, uh, cold resistance food. Like, wow, this is bad. Everywhere I go, it's cold, cold, cold. I can't believe I ran out of the food, actually. Okay, so this is the place where it's still a war uh, warm. Okay, I guess screw those skull places. We're not gonna go there right now. But what I want to know is, like, is it cold over there as well? I don't know, but I, I sure hope it isn't. Because I don't want it to be cold there. What is this? Is this just, like, a mushroom or something? Yeah, we don't... I'm not gonna bother... But, um, yes, I am. I am gonna bother grabbing that. Go grab it. It's just a Russian, but you know, you know how I do. I can't just run past things. <coughs> totally haven't run past things in the series before. <coughs> yeah. Well, in this game, it's almost impossible to, like, not run past things. 
because there are so many things you can't do, and then they're like, yeah, it's just, it's just, uh, you, you can't not skip stuff. Okay, now, I, I am honestly super intrigued by that huge thing over there. Like, I, I do not, I do not know what to expect. I'm just incredibly, incredibly excited, and also incredibly worried that I might, uh, freeze to death over there. But I, at least I think, like, they gave us back our food since we came over, and, like, we, uh, resumed from our last save point. Okay, where's- oh, we're noticing some pop in here, but, like, honestly, doesn't bother me too much. is not too noticeable. What is that thing? Is that one of the divine beasts? Like, I do not remember how they look like, but this could be one of the divine beasts. I don't know. Or is this, like, a huge moving factory? Or a huge shop, like the Beatles, um, airship from Skyward Sword? I don't know, guys. What is happening? What is this? What is this madness? Am I playing a Zelda game? I'm running around a huge open world. Ah, uh, it's cold. It's cold. Guys, no! No, screw this. Is there any way we can cook stuff? Like somewhere around. Is that a guard? That's a guardian. That is a guardian. Wait. Oh my god, guys. These things. Are these establishments of sorts? I mean, look at this. Is this a Gerudo town thing? I don't know. Are these guardians mobile? Can they move? Can they... Are they alive? Since it looks like there's an establishment nearby, I would hope that these things can't move, like they're just dormant. But just in case, I'm gonna save right over here at this uh, guardian. Whoa, and we're still in the Gerudo Highlands. Like, this area reaches really far. Don't wake up. Please be dormant. Please. Okay. Good. Good, good, good. This guy's also... Also... Also asleep. Thank goodness for that. I did not want to fight a guardian, and by fight I meant just die because I can't. Oh, this mushroom glow grows wild in the Gerudo region. The cap is naturally insulated, so when using cooking, it will offer protection against electricity. Cool. Okay, guys. So this is actually, I think this is the Gerudo town. I don't know, guys. Uh, I will find out in the next episode, guys. I think the episode is long enough already. So yeah, I'm gonna end it right here. So thanks for watching, everybody. I really hope you enjoyed the video. We finally reached some sort of a place. I don't know what this is. Hoping it's the Gerudo Town, but I guess we'll see in the next video. So thanks for watching. Peace out. Wait, that's the wrong order. I have to say thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like, comment, share. Do other stuff like that, and then... Peace out. Bye, guys. Thanks for everything you've done. Even if you haven't done anything, thanks for whatever you have done. That didn't make sense. Start watching. Peace out, guys.